Hey guys, I just wanted to go over a little something I've been doing in my off time. I'm working on some 3D printing. So, this is the little planter pot that I started working on. And uh, that's at about 25% done. And uh, I kind of took pictures of each progress every 25%. So this is about 50%. And uh, I wanted to go show people the process of what happens after everything's done. So here it's about 75%. And then I go right on in to about 80%. So I'll kind of describe what uh, happens when it's done. All right. So now we're done. 100% completed. So what we got to do now, we got to take it off the hotbed, off the printing platform. See these little things here? These are called brims. They keep the plastic from warping while it's printing. These things, as you can see how it looks so much different from this, it has all this extra stuff. See how soft it is? Those are supports or helpers. They help keep overhanging parts of the object from sagging they keep it supported as it's printing but what you have to do is you have to take like a really good putty knife which actually comes with the printer and you got to get under and get and you have to break it loose can't do this with one hand but let me get this broken loose from the printing surface and I'll show you what's next so now we're left with this so what I have to do now is you have to break all this off you have to get inside it and clean it all out it's a lot of you'd think it was a lot of wasted print but uh it's necessary or else it won't come out right. So let me get all this broken off. So even the bottom here, you have to, you have to take something and get down inside and rip the bottom out. And clean all this up. And then you'll get your final product. So let me get all this cleaned off. So now you can see I took the bottom off, but now see you have to take a knife and you have to clean all those ridges off. And then you can see inside all those helpers and supports that are inside that have got to get cleaned out. Then you have to clean around the edges. You have to clean them up really good after it's done. So you can see some stringers in there that need to be cleaned off. Let me get it all cleaned up. And there you have it. It still needs a little bit of cleaning up but everything inside has been removed. I mean, there's some weird imperfections like uh, right there where the printer did some, I don't know if that's from the stepper motor skipping or, I don't know, but it doesn't look bad. It's, it's pretty big. I mean, I didn't have, I didn't have that problem on here. So maybe because I printed it so big. I don't know. But it came out pretty good. Not too bad. Took uh, like three, three days to print. And used a whole roll of uh, filament. So I still got... Uh, Looks good. Put this down here, this trash can. There you go, that's the finished product. And to let you know, this is done with a Tronxy Tron XY2 Pro Titan printer. And tell me if you like it. 